have fought well, but I have rotted wood, quenched flame, leveled mountain, and pitted iron. How will you face me? Succeed in battle, one must be fluid, moving around obstacles, enveloping your foes. You have earned passage to the celestial shrine atop the mountain. Go to the village, where you will find the golden ladder.
Greetings. I am Kao Tsu, your humble servant. May I shine a light on the darkness of your existence. You bear with you pieces of Marco Poyo's map. He was once my student and learned much within the celestial shrine. Chief among his studies was astrology, the movement of stars through the heavens and the alignment of the worlds of the spiral. His map contains a secret, symbols, revealing the path to Shangri-La, city of the immortals, Poyo called it El Dorado. I will teach you how to read the symbols and decipher my student's map. They reveal where and when the next gate to Shangri-La will open. But you must have all the tables to make such a prediction. You need all of the pieces of the map to find Shangri-La. I see much from my vantage point in the Celestial Shrine. I know that the Armada has two pieces of the map, and you also, too. Three pieces are yet to be accounted for, but one will come to light soon. Your friend with the bird has news for you. Every quest has an end, and yours is some distance off. But for now, you must return to where it began. Your arrival is fortuitous. I have important news for you. A clue to the next piece of Marco Pollo's map. I'm glad you're back, pirate. I fear both our efforts to get pieces of the map have run into a snag. While you were away, I sent several of my hearties to get Catbeard's map piece. But they didn't find hide or whisker of him. Did they look in his hideout cave? The one carved to look like a monster? Cave? Why, I... Uh, no, I don't think so. How'd they miss it? It's only the most conspicuous thing in the whole Skyway. But did you hire Finn again? Well, since you're so familiar with it, I trust you're the crew for the job. Be off with you now. Remember, time is of the essence. I shudder to think of our fate if the Armada gets any more of the map. say. You there, you're standing on me blindside. Are you a boy or a girl? What's your name, pirate? Maybe so. If you are who you say you are, prove it. We know you're an orphan. How'd you lose your parents? Your parents weren't eaten by a sky squid? Tragic. Ah, oh, so sad. It happens all the time. So, who raised you then? Where'd you grow up? 
You were raised in far off Grizzleheim. A bear clan took you in, I take it. Only the strong survive in Grizzleheim. You must be tough indeed. So how did you end up locked in this brig? What crime did the Armada arrest you for? Arrested for brawling with Armada troops? Good for you! You must be a buccaneer. Buccaneers are exceedingly tough and strong. What distinguishing marks have you got? You know, hair color and style, expression and whatnot. must dress to impress. How do you present yourself? You're gonna need a flag. Every self-respecting pirate needs a flag. Select an icon for your flag. Use the color buttons to choose its base and trim colors. Choose how the field behind the icon is arranged. Use the color buttons to choose the base and trim of your flag's field. The colors you pick for your flag will also be used by your crew for their uniforms, so you can keep track of them in a fight. Now let's get you out of this confounded cell. There's piracing to be done. 